Buongiorno and benvenuti to YouTube. This is fan of gaming. And I've got more space pirates and zombies today. Now I did record yesterday, but being the moron that I am, I recorded my audio and not the game. So it is the exact opposite problem as I had last time. Uh, and it's okay though, because now I'm using a two save system. So instead of just telling you what you missed, I can just load the older save and do everything again. So let's get started. <coughs> Uh, let me show you what I did on the star map that is no longer in effect. I had gone here, which I think I am now, yes. I bought the suicide cannon. Uh, I went here, and then I unlocked this gate after a pretty difficult battle in which I actually lost some ships. Uh, I, I spotted a new ship when I was breaking the blockade, too. It was interesting. Uh, and that was about it, really. You didn't miss too much. I did a few missions, leveled up a couple times. It was it wasn't too bad, really. Huh. Uh, but yeah, let's let's get back to it. What's over here? Oh yeah. Anyway, I I, I try to unlock this system because they have a lot of awesome tech that I would like. But uh, if I can't do it, then too bad. So let's try to break the blockade, I guess. Last time I tried once, then I failed miserably, then I came back and tried again, and I actually ended up pulling it off. <laughs> Let me check my hangers first. Uh, this is looking good. Alright. Yeah. Alright, let's do it. It's gonna be a tough battle, and they might have a new ship called the Helix, which is a large hull ship, the first one I've spotted so far. So let's uh let's do it. I'm probably gonna lose. They actually ended up destroying the gate. And yep, there's a helix and two rangers, which is also a new ship. I spotted three new ships when I recorded this last time. Three oh god yeah the helix has mass bombs by the way. Very dangerous ship. You'll notice they've already destroyed my tug. And there's really no point trying to rebuild it, but I will anyway, because I'm stupid. Or I can be stupid. And, yeah, now they're going to destroy the gate. <clears throat> yeah. I did a bit better last time, but it's okay. So I'll rebuild all my ships. And I guess I'll be a moron and try again. I did learn something interesting. If you go back, even after losing, uh, they don't have the same ships. Like, if you destroy one, it stays gone. They, they don't bring it back. It's awesome. Let's see. I could do this first. It'd give me a good chance to level up and imp improve my relations with the civilians. <laughs> so I could buy the, the uh, suicide cannon. Uh, which one of these do I want to do, though? They both seem to be basically the same thing. I'll do this one. If I'm lucky, I might be able to do this without pissing off the UTA, and never mind, they're already here, so I'll have to kill them now. Let's see, they've got two hatchets and a gull. Not three hatchets, my mistake. I don't know how I missed one of them. I'm feeling I'm not supposed to shoot this item here. Let's see. Oh dear. Okay, their goals have mass bombs now, so that makes them priority targets. If the, if the AI uses the mass bomb really well, it's very possible for it to be lethal. As I learned in my very difficult fight with the Helix. But I've also used them to actually have the enemy ships destroy themselves, almost. I mean, they're not really that good. They don't do that much damage, at least the lower level ones. So I really don't have to worry about them. But, still. It, as I understand, they do basically nothing against shields. But if my shield's already down, they'll probably do a lot of damage to my hull. Uh, looks like they destroyed one of my ships. 
may have to rebuild it because it's getting a little bit hairy. <sighs> These guys are becoming very annoying right now. I have a feeling that tug's gonna be annoying. Yeah, it's got those missiles and a laser. My shield's almost down too. I have to back out of range and launch missiles at it. Yeah, it seems to be doing a good job. Alright, we got him. Goodness. Two gimps. This is quite troublesome. Could get that data, but I really don't need it. Well, I need it, but I'll be getting a lot more when I'm done with this. Uh, looks like the next thing's kind of far away. There's a gull down there, but I'm just going to have my AI ships assist me. So I'll have them come over here. Dang, this thing's kind of far away, isn't it? Let's see if we can destroy some of these boxes and get some goodies. A little bit of res. I was hoping for data. No, nope, no data. Nothing worth trying anymore. Alright, now I just gotta get to the station. These hatchets probably won't even be able to touch me. My shield, at least. I mean, my hull. They'll probably be able to take out my shield, though. I could take out that gull, but I just want to finish this damn mission. <clears throat> I can't talk today, can I? Oh, just woke up, kind of tired. Voice is a little bit weak. Star infrastructure maxed? What? I have no idea what that means. Alright. Yeah, as I think I've demonstrated, those mass bombs can really be dangerous to your ships. You can't shoot them though, that's kind of interesting. Yeah, they really don't seem to do anything uh, unless your shields are worn out. It's a good thing this goal is slightly slower than mine is. My ship, I mean. Come on. I just need two shots at you. There we go. There we go. I managed to destroy it before it got close. Alright, now I gotta take out that gimp. Before I do that though, I wanna upgrade beams by one point. That's what I did last time. So I'm just gonna do the same thing. That gimp's kinda far away. It's closer to the tug. All right, let's see. Let's just take out this gimp real quick. And we can warp out of here. There we go. A little bit of data. All right. Civilians should now like us. Let's go buy that suicide cannon. Or one part of it. I think we need two parts. I have no idea what mount it goes on. I have a sneaking suspicion that it can go on any mount, but I really don't know. I guess I'll find out once I finally do unlock a thing. <laughs> this is the main reason I don't want to attack these large stations. They've got all these crazy drones. They don't seem to do too much damage, and I'm pretty sure you can like, just fire a random laser and kill most of them, but still seem to be a little bit annoying. I think they I think they're repairing my ships too. I'm not sure. Alright, let's see. We can buy this. Yeah, we'll buy it. Alright. Need one more part to get it. Now I think we're ready to try this thing again. A little bit nervous. Alright, let's do it though. I'm going to take out the two smaller ships first. 
then if the helix survives, we'll take him out next time for sure. I gotta avoid that mass bomb though. Helix, the thing's pretty tough. This Ranger, I believe, is a uh, small hole, just like my turtle heads. So if I unlock it, I'll probably be replacing the turtle heads. All right. Uh, yes, I'm gonna rebuild my ships because we can actually take him out as now. I could probably aim for that uh, mass bomb and blow it up for you, I mean, but. Doesn't matter much. He's now gonna destroy it. Try to destroy my gate, but I'm gonna lure him around while my other ships are rebuilding, and I'm gonna take control of my tug. He now stands no chance whatsoever. It's him against three smaller ships. Oh yeah, you need five. You need to kill five of these things to unlock the design, which is just quite unreasonable in my opinion. Did you just shoot down one of my missiles. I really think he did. Right. I think his mass bomb blew him up, actually. Right. Yeah, he drops a lot of data, too. What is this? It's just like a giant escape pod, I guess. Oh, dear. Alright, we lost quite a few goons there. Wait, I want to check something. Okay, good. Still 25 and 75. I had set it to a, a higher level at some point. Like, I had so many goons, it set it to 100 to each. 100% full on all my ships. But I had turned it out. Turned it down, so. I just wanted to see if it was still there. Which it's not. Which is good. Oh, I think that's a new sign. It's upside down, though. I can't read it. Oh well. Okay, we've got enough goons. Alright, that went a little bit better than I expected, honestly. So, let's uh, warp into our new system. Precium Prime, or Precium, or something. I don't know, I might have totally read it wrong. It could be something totally different. Uh, Precium Prime. Interesting. Alright. Now, both the civilians and the UTA have a lot of tech to offer me in this system, and I'm nowhere near balls enough to try to destroy any of their ships, I mean stations, to get the tech from them, because when you destroy stations you get their tech. So I'm just going to have to try to please everyone, or maybe I'll just pick sides, pick one and just go with it. I'll probably do that because it's a heck of a lot easier. They're attacking the clockwork. I'm pretty sure it's indestructible or very close to it. Oh, no. more ships. Nothing but turtle heads. Gosh, totally useless ships. Except for when I use them, in which case they're kind of awesome. It's a total double standard. Don't you judge me. Right? Stop taking a crap in the cargo chute. Interesting. Well said. Alright, we've got enough. Let's check our research. I think last time I tried to update hull. Increases crew capacity. It's kind of useless to me right now, though. Could increase crew. Shuttle arm plus. It's useless. Crew recruiting chance. Eh, not too useful. Could boost armor. That would help a bit. Not too much, though. Quite a bit, though. I could do that. I could boost engines. Turn speed boost. That's not too useful. Oh uh, gosh, I remember having a hard time trying to decide which one I wanted to boost last time. What about subsystems? That's kind of useful. Useless, I mean. Hmm. I'll upgrade hull. Why not? That particular upgrade isn't too helpful, but this next one will be quite helpful. Oops. Alright. So we've managed to fight off the ambush. It was a very expected ambush. Okay, I could do this. Make the UTA happy. Probably anger the civilians while I'm at it. 
Wait, let's see. The civilians only have two techs for me. And this is the only one I want. I don't really want the reactor booster module. The UTA have a lot more tech that I can use, though. Like, they have the... Well, I can't use that. But they have the uh, double mount turret, which will be very useful. Especially for my tug. Uh, could you... Uh, uh, they also have the thruster engine, which I want. So, uh, I'll team up with the UTA.